Assalamu alaikum everyone hope you are doing well i am sana in this video i'll give you some brief introduction about the subconjunctival hemorrhage before it gets started we should know about what is hemorrhage and what is subconjunctival hemorrhage is defined as the escape of blood from the ruptured blood vessel the area between the conjunctiva and sclera is known as the subconjunctiva Underneath the conjunctiva, there are various small blood vessels where they are very delicate in nature and they can easily rupture on a small force. It's not very uncommon to have bloodshot eyes. When people get bloodshot eyes, they become very scared because of its unusual appearance. So conjunctival hemorrhage or bloodshot eyes is bleeding from a small blood vessel over the whites of the eye. It results in a localized bright spot in the white of the eye. In the given case, the patient came to the hospital with complaint of blood in her right eye along with the gritty sensation. We take her detailed history and it became clear that she had high blood pressure one day before and on the next morning, her daughter noticed the blood in her diseased eye. After performing her thorough examination, we located IOP, pupillary responses, and fundus exam, all were clear. No abnormality was detected. Common causes of subconjunctival hemorrhage include coughing, sneezing, straining, stress, vomiting, and risk factors include diabetes, high blood pressure. To properly manage the bloodshot eyes, it is necessary to diagnose with the sign and symptoms. Treatment basically, there is no specific treatment required in a subconjunctival hemorrhage because it is a spontaneous resolution in 7 to 14 days. If patient complains itching, gritty sensation, then you can prescribe antibiotics or artificial tears. But do not give steroids because they will delay the healing process. Patients should con consult with their physician if they are using anticoagulant medications. If you are having pain or blur vision, then go to your eye doctor immediately because these are not the signs of subconjunctival hemorrhage. Its prognosis are good because after 7 to 14 days, there will be no more cleft. Hope you liked the video. Thank you so much. Allah Hafiz.